the final election map, Donald Trump losing in a landslide to Joe Biden and Kamala Harris in the general election. Anyone but Donald Trump, the top narrative of the election, the worst president ever who said that I don't take responsibility for the coronavirus, that it is what it is. It doesn't matter how many people die. You're not going to get your checks. Uh, Donald Trump, uh, his GOP Senate is on recess. They're, they're, the Democrats put a bill on their desk for $3 trillion to give every American extension on 600 a week, but the Republicans have said no, so this guarantees that Trump is losing the landslide. Donald Trump gave tax breaks for the wealthy. He praised dictators. He failed to build a wall. He failed to repeal and replace. He's the biggest con in the history of America. Anyone that criticizes him, he resorts to the childish Twitter attacks. This guy lacks the temperament of a president. This guy's a big, giant joke. Nothing but facts here in this channel. Donald Trump, the low turnout, is not going to help him. He's going to win Indiana. Donald Trump's a big-time loser. He's a big-time... You Just think for a second that you have to be a big fucking loser to lose to Joe Biden and Kamala Harris. A big, fat loser. That's what Donald Trump is. He's nothing but a loser to lose to some of the crappiest candidates for president in the history of the world. That's what Joe Biden is. Donald Trump has lost Texas. He's lost Florida. He's going to lose Georgia. He's winning South Carolina. He's losing North Carolina. He's losing Virginia. He's losing all these places. Donald Trump is getting slaughtered in this election. I would give Ohio... Ohio's the only one that I'm fishy about. Ohio can easily go uh, Republican, but o Ohio's had enough of Donald Trump. They're going to go blue as well. And Arizona's going to go blue for this election. These states can go red in 2024. It is going to take years to recover from the disastrous presidency of Donald Trump. Anyone but Donald Trump. Donald Trump has sold off the Republican Party to these deep state Zionist powers. Donald Trump is a big, giant joke. He really is. It really is a joke that someone like him is president in the first place. And coming from a liberal progressive, I'm not a Democrat. I'm a liberal progressive. I, I don't go by Democrat. Bernie's not a Democrat. He's a liberal progressive. There are no real progressive. There is no real opposing progressive party in America. There's nothing but right-wing extremist parties. And so as it stands, Trump's losing Texas. He's losing Florida. He's losing Arizona. He's losing Georgia. He's losing Ohio. He's losing Pennsylvania. He's losing all of these states. Donald Trump is a big, fat fucking loser. A big time loser. I wouldn't be surprised if Joe Biden wins by over 400 electoral votes. This is a four year 2020. Donald Trump is a 13 4 light path. 13 is a karmic number. You remember the celebrity apprentice? Oh, you're fired? Well, the American people are going to fire this guy big time. 412 to 126 guaranteed Biden's going to win by over 320 electoral votes. We're going to go with over 330. Electoral votes. This is going to be an epic electoral slaughter, and this is what's going to happen to Donald Trump. He is a absolute big failure of a president who is trying to destroy the United States post office, like his idols Putin and Mussolini and Hitler. He is using force against v peaceful protesters, protesting against police brutality in the systematic racism that you have to think people like Kamala Harris and Joe Biden who are nothing but Republicans. Nothing but Republicans, but better than the alternative. This is going to be an epic landslide victory on November the 3rd of 2020. It doesn't matter who is running with Joe Biden. He's not the worst president in American history. He's not a Manchurian puppet of Russia. He is certainly not any of that. Donald Trump wants to get rid of Social Security entirely by getting rid of the payroll tax. Joe Biden, he wants to cut Medicare and Social Security. He's nothing but a Republican, but he's not Donald Trump. That is for sure. Joe Biden is not going to expand Medicare. He's not going to have Medicare for all. Joe Biden is a Republican, but he's better than the right-wing fascist libertarian ideology that it's going to really be rampant in the Republican Party throughout the 2020s. 
the two evils, the corporate Democrats, the corporate centrist wing, the center right wing, and then the far right fascist wing. Nothing but two far right parties. The Republican Party is the absolute worst. 